All right, what's going on guys? This is Tom here and today Terry Bogart is out brand new character He's an SNK boy from King of Fighters and he brings with him a New unique playstyle to try out and uh, I see you will bitching be uh, because of the motions And I don't understand because they're not really complex at all But kudos to Sakurai for including uh, half circle motions in a Smash Bros game and that's hilarious to me Anywho, let's get started because yeah, we got to find out if this character's good or not all right, so I expect to see nothing but Terry's, and that's totally fine. Hopefully we can find one where you can learn from. So Terry is very, very unique in that he has the ability to cancel his abilities, or his supers. Oh, that's pretty good damage. But he's, a he's basically a Street Fighter boy. There we go. I gotta figure out the spikes. Does it spike? Oh, we'll find out now. See, he's got, so you see how he's got the, the go there. There we go. Okay, so. I could already tell I like Terry better. Oh, shit! The dash attack's a kill move. That's great to know, actually. I could already tell I like him better than, than Ryu and Ken. He seems to fit my, my play style a little bit better. Kawa wave. He definitely fits my playstyle better than those two did. And he seems like a lot of fun. Let's go. I thought I could do something a little sneaky. Oh! That's one thing I actually like, though. He keeps... Oh! He keeps the meter as long as he's above 100%. So he has his own sort of limit mechanic. Did you just ask me if I'm okay? Okay, so one thing that I saw that's pretty nuts... Oh, I wasn't paying attention! He just, I just let him hit me. Let's, uh, let's kill this guy. He's just gonna keep mashing out the, the supers, huh? Let's go. That was supposed to be a... Let's just... Oh, if I do the, the Shoryuken motion, it does, it does this. I didn't know that. I didn't realize that all of his moves had, uh, had motions. There we go, burn knuckle. I know he's got some some grab combos. There we go. Okay, doing what Sakurai said. The anti-air. Okay, this character seems better than I expected. Ah, so one thing I actually wanted to check. Let's go. Ooh, that's pretty cool. Power. Oh. Nope, oh, that was dangerous. Aw, would've been kinda cool. Let's finish him off. How does he kill at low percentages? That's what we gotta figure out. Oh, we got him! We just kick him! That's how we do it. What I need to figure out is uh, if I could shorten the motions by using the C-Stick. Because that seems something I should be able to do, but I haven't had the chance to test it. But he seems cool. Fun character. That's all I got so far. Okay, someone not playing Terry is kinda interesting. But this should be fine. Let's go. So Terry's got some pretty cool combos. Let's see. Power wave. This is people just trying to take advantage of the fact that there's a new character we don't know how to use to get into Elite Smash. I see your games. Oh, we got the lucky one. Oh. Let's see. Hold on, hold on. Yep. <laughs> Let's 
Sorry, I'm not talking too much. This character does require a bit of focus. Let's go. So you can catch an anti-air for a kill. That's pretty cool. This character reminds me a lot of, like, better Little Mac. There we go. Get some free damage there. Ah, uh, sure. This guy's way too good to not be in the lead smash, by the way, with Peach. I thought he actually went too low. Okay. Okay, that's not what I meant to do. Not what I did. So, like, the inputs aren't a problem when they work. Oh, the anti-air. Holy shit, that's good. But it, they seem to not be incredibly reliable, which is kind of annoying. I'd, I'd much prefer, like, a D-pad, I guess. Maybe that would help. Oh. So I can just fucking spam this shit, huh? And he's also Peach, so, you know. You just do the Peach stuff. There we go. This character's recovery is not fantastic, by the way. What is it with the blonde-haired, blue-eyed boys and bad recovery? Oh my god, it doesn't fucking sweet spot? That's so annoying. There we go. Oh, he played himself. Oh, no, he didn't. Why'd that not, not turn around? What the fuck? What the fuck? Well, I have no clue why he didn't grab the edge, and that's incredibly annoying. Okay, so I learned that Burn Knuckle does not grab the ledge if I go anywhere near it, and that shit ain't cool. So, let's just... Oh, let's just do that. Oh, I was not supposed to be uh, that. Kind of a hard attack to block, huh? Let's go. It's going just fine. Just <laughs> mash out special moves. Let's see, hold on. Ooh! Okay, his tilts aren't kill tilts. Good to know. But his dash attack is super good. It seems to be his main kill option when he doesn't have meter. Get out of here. Bayo. Get out of here. This ain't your game no more, girl. Hold on. Oh, that sucks. Looks like up tilt is basically the combo starter here. Sure. Okay. Got him. Let's go. No! It did the fucking input, the Shoryu input, instead of... So, I have an issue with these inputs. I do the correct input, and for some reason it does the incorrect input.
Girl, girl, you gotta chill. Get that stacked. I wish he had some kind of throw combos at high percentages. Hard to punish. Ooh, he went to dodge and fucked himself. This is fine for me. Oh, I thought I timed that right, but I guess not. Okay. I should just block more because Bale doesn't really have much how to sh like uh, shield punish options, does she? Okay, this is going fine. Dude, Bayo, I'm so sorry for what they've done to you. There we go. The reversal. Let's go. Okay, okay. That's clearly one of his better kills. It's super fast, turns into a kill if you just land it. At not too high percentages. That wasn't bad. That wasn't bad. We're going to keep going before I'm content, I think. And sometimes he just likes to fly off the stage on his own. Ah. What the fuck? Oh my god, dude. His recovery is so bad. His recovery is really, really bad. Bayo gets a free spike because of that bad recovery. Because the burn knuckle, like the side, it it's, doesn't grab the ledge. And Bayo gets a free fucking spike off of that. That's crazy. <laughs> Sometimes it's the best option. I got really quiet trying to land those fucking power geysers. But, my opinion on him so far, I think that he's going to be... Like, his recovery and the fact that his kill options... Like... He has a unique thing, which is cool. What's not cool, though, he needs to be over 100% health every time to use it. And I have yet to survive long enough in, in over 100% health to really get much out of these. He seems to be very, very lightweight, which I'm not really a big fan of. And then you get shit like that. Like, you see that? He should have won that match. Because he had the supers and the re and I was recovering, but I won because of stupidity. And, like, it'll take a little more. This is not my final opinion on him. He's got the power and the style. I like I like the character. But, like, just the fact that he's so reliant on being in the danger zone in health. And the fact that his recovery is so piss poor to the point where he's going to get spiked into oblivion. It's going to take some work to make this character really, really good. Now then. To get to get the good, to give him some credit though, he he's similar to Cloud, blonde hair, blue eyed boy needs to be in the center of the stage to be effective. If you can keep him on the stage, preferably on a final destination stage, because battlefield is clearly an issue with those platforms in the way. But if you can keep him on a final destination stage in the center of the stage and really get good at like landing these big hits at over 100, if you could survive over 100, he'll be good. But he seems super super light, so it's really tough to say. But guys, this is just my quick, super, super quick first impression of the character. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And uh, yeah, that's really all I've got right now. Expect more tomorrow. Hopefully, I'll refine a little bit by then. But as of right now, I would say Terry is a fun character to play. But I wouldn't put him very high on, the tier, on, on anyone's tier list right now. But alright guys, this is Tom. Hope you enjoyed my opinion on the character.